people, I don't, I never understood why people say that you have to keep your personal life uh, separate from your business life because it really never worked with me and my company. So I could create Emirates World Club because my private life was my business. So all these networks, all these relationships I was maintaining, but it had always to be very genuine, I have to say. So those CEOs are my friends, those GMs are my friends. So when they have a question, when they want to go out, when they need a recommendation, they just take the phone and they call me. If I have clients who would like to meet those CEOs and I create a dinner for them, them, I just pick up the phone and call them. So it's a very nice casual relationship. It's very casual but it's by uh, invitation only, it's by reg registration only so people can invite of course their friends and clients but we have always to check the designation uh, of the person and the company profile and then we confirm their attendance. So uh, these are the networking clubs for the whole club. Then we have our private gatherings which are the Emirates World Club's private society dinners which uh, we also organize frequently. Now for example we have twice a month such a dinner where we invite up to 20 top CEOs, GMs or vice presidents and then they network together. We have always the best restaurants in Dubai which we choose uh, for our private dinners. And now we are also thinking to uh, start our own private getaways, so um, meaning taking 12 to 15 CEOs, GMs or vice presidents to a nice resort, maybe to Oman or somewhere and just to create a nice weekend for them. So Emirates World Club's event are purely, I would say up to 95% attended by the senior management only. So whoever as a company, as a product owner is looking for the right exposure, the right brand exposure, to high net worth individuals, to VIPs, to GMs and vice presidents, then Emirates World Club is exactly the right platform. Um, are we talking about a small brand of a car? They would be totally wrong at Emirates World Club's event because nobody will buy their car at the end. Nobody's interested in the brand. So it is really only for the brands who are targeting uh, the VIPs or I would say the high society um, the, who have the wealth status or the power to buy their brands. Now uh, we have built a database, a network of 6,000 um, CEOs, GMs and vice presidents. So through also my other corporate events which I organize for my clients, of course, the network was always growing and growing. I think the most important part is being genuine. You have to be very authentic, you have to be real and um, as soon as they realize that you have an agenda, uh, they will pull a step back. So um, you have to understand if you want those networks, those relationships, it's not because you are looking for a commercial, uh, commercial benefit. So you're not looking for a commercial benefit, you are looking for making friends. And of course, everybody understands that you want to have friends who are strong, who are influencers in terms of business. Of course, that's very natural. So they understand you are speaking to them because they are at high positions, but you are interested also in their personality. Um, and maintaining those relationships, I never asked for any favor um, unless it was really necessary. So, but when I asked for a favor, maybe I got a no and I treated the person the next few years exactly the same way. So I never changed and this is very important. This is how you build trust. I think trust is the most important factor in any kind of relationship, if it's personal or business, if it's in the UAE or it's in the States. So everywhere trust is the foundation what is important. And people are looking too much for immediate benefits and that, I'm sorry to say, but this is exactly the wrong Thing to do and uh, as, because those CEOs are very smart otherwise they wouldn't be at this position those GMs are very smart so even if you try to decorate your request they will see through it and that's the worst part if they understand that you're actually looking for some benefits they will sit with you they will have their coffee and then they will say goodbye 